Hello and welcome to the RPM Drive App 2.0 training material. Today we're going to be going over how to log in, shipment process, pickup process, delivery process, damage reporting for OEM and remarketing loads, feedback and bug reporting, and how to contact us with any questions. Step one, how to log in. Open the RPM Drive app, select the country, enter the driver's phone number, and press send code button. A five digit SMS verification code will be sent to the user's phone. Enter that code into the SMS verification code box and press login to continue. Pickup process. The user will receive a text message on a shipment assignment. Once login is completed, the default main screen will show the user's assigned shipments. Click on Start Shipment button at the bottom of the screen to begin. Click on the Pickup section or the arrow of the shipment to see more details. Drive to the Pickup location. Upon arrival, you can click on Scan VIN or Scan Any VIN on Shipment button to start scanning. The scan screen will automatically start scanning. If the scanning function is not working, then the user can always select Add Manually. User can scan VIN plates, barcodes, or QR codes. If and when utilizing the manual entry function, the user will need to manually enter the VIN and add a reason as well as a picture of the VIN. Click Submit to finish. To add damages, click on the Add Damages button to record any damages before submitting all paperwork. Click on Add Signature and Paperwork button to complete the last step. Completing the pickup. Tap Add Signature and Paperwork. Have the customer sign on the signature pad. Upload any necessary documents or paperwork and tap Submit to complete. It's important to verify that all details are proper before submitting. Delivery process. Click on the arrow to start delivery once the user has arrived at the destination. Follow the same steps as pickup. Drive to the location, scan the VINs, report damages if any, and collect a signature. Again, it's proper to ensure that everything is accurate before finalizing. Click on Add Damages button to record any damages before submitting all paperwork. And then click on Add Signature and Paperwork button to complete the last step. Completing the delivery. Tap Add Signature and Paperwork to the bottom of the screen. Have the customer sign on the signature pad and tap Submit to complete. Again, please verify that all details are proper before submitting. Damage reporting for OEM shipments. You can click on the Add Damages button. That will bring up the diagram of the vehicle. Select the location of the damage, type of damage, and the severity of damage. It is always important to upload a photo of said damages as well. That way we have proper reporting. Damage reporting for remarketing, you're going to click on Add Damages, select the damage type, and then go ahead and also take a picture of said damage. Once you've done so, please click Submit. Feedback and bug reporting. From the home screen, you can click on the three line icon at the top left corner to access feedback and bug reporting. From there, a drop down menu will appear. You can click on the report bugs and feedback and then go ahead and submit what the bug or possible enhancements that we could make to make life a little easier for you in that area. Contact us. 
The user can reach out to RPM via phone, text, SMS, and or email. You can see on the screen there, it gives you three options. Once you click on one of those options, a drop down menu will come at the bottom of the screen. You can select from those prompts. If you are in real time at a delivery location or an origin and need immediate assistance, the easiest way to get a hold of us would be to contact your carrier representative. They can get in touch with the proper person here at RPM that can help troubleshoot your issue in real time and try to get a fix for the issue. Thank you. For questions or inquiries, please visit www.rpmmoves.com.